Okay, I made these notes earlier this evening, and I'm just going to play them all and reply at the end. It's 41 seconds of a 1 minute 51 second video, so I might as well just play them all. Life is at best a sitcom. Life is at worst a third world country with starving children. Or life is at worst someone with cancer or parasites in their bowels. Um, opposition, you'd say? What do you find so valuable about a sitcom? A warm and fuzzy inside. It gives me a little teddy bear hug feeling. Dreadful suffering shit. Ugh, I don't understand how you people can be so damn trivial. <clears throat> Anyways. Alright, so at best... Life is at best a sitcom. Um, do you, I mean, do you, I would suggest you might want to read some biographies. I mean, uh, if you read the biography of Gandhi, it's very interesting. First of all, you, the autobiography, you'll find, uh, I think, uh, that Gandhi is not just a saint of some sort. He was a human being. He had certain tendencies, certain even obsessions that had caused problems as well as his successes which were great. Um, if you read that and you see in there a sitcom, that might be just media damage, Western media damage. Maybe you've seen so many sitcoms uh, that it's a metaphor for everything to you. you. Life is like TV. Well, yeah, no wonder you think life is worthless. If you apply that metaphor to, you know, Gandhi's life, which not really a sitcom, it has positive and negative, uh, but not really a sitcom. I think it's pretty much proven. Um, you guys talk a lot a about. Warm and fuzzy inside. It gives me a little teddy bear hug feeling. See, you guys, you t want to talk about trivial? I mean, that is trivial. And I'm not really talking about antinatalism here. I'm talking about the way you think, heroin church. A teddy bear hug? That's just, that's an illusion as far as, the, because the teddy bear isn't real. It's like you hugging yourself with a prosthetic, you know, idea of love and fuzzy. Or maybe if it's really well made, you know, it literally is warm, but it's still an inanimate object. If you want to use a hug, what about a, uh, you know, a hug of a, a kitten, a kitten that comes up and, you know, while you're sleeping and nestles down. How about that as an example, or hugging another person, or Gandhi's life instead of a sitcom? I mean, okay, the question. Um, opposition, you would say? What do you find so valuable about a sitcom? Well, they're funny. Um, like Soap was a sitcom, so that pretty much proves sitcom could be a work of art, it generally isn't, but Soap was, I think Soap was a sitcom, and it was really awesome, so let's say that, that shows at least by example there exists an X such that X is a sitcom and X is an awesome thing. Um, they, uh, you know, they're minus entertainment, but uh, life is obviously not like a sitcom unless you live it that way. So maybe, maybe that's the issue. Yeah, probably. I think that's probably the... You choose to live life like a sitcom, it's meaningless.